Hey everybody, Jared Duckett, Duckett Lad CPAs and Advisors here with my business partner, Buzzsaw. Buzzsaw, how you doing, my friend? Doing well, Jared. How are you doing? I'm doing good, man. I just thought we'd jump on here real fast. The last uh, video we shot on the, I guess let's call it the Advanced Child Tax Credit. You know, we mentioned we jump back on here when the, I guess the portal is active so people could go on there and unenroll. Um, and from what I hear, it's active. So I'll just kind of throw it to you real fast. Um, you know, how, how do you go unenroll now that it's it's active? Yeah, so there's a, a portal now that the IRS has launched last week that allows you to go sign in, you know, they'll match up your tax ID number and everything. There, there might be an ID number you have to sign up for. Um, but yeah, once you figure out how to log in, you log in, you can start to, the unenrollment process. Now, um, this is something that both you and your spouse will wanna do um, because if you're married filing jointly, if only one of you unenroll, then you're, you'll still get half of the payment coming to your bank account. So you wanna make sure that both sides of the married filing jointly return go in individually and unenroll um, separately from each other. Yeah, no, that's a great point. You would think it would just be one, but yeah, if, if you're married filing jointly, both of you go in so that you don't receive any of it, um, if that makes sense. And I have heard from a couple individuals that have done this, that there is a lot of um, uh, ID verification that goes on. So make sure you've got stuff handy, you know, to verify your, you know, your identity and, and maybe have you even heard like a picture or something that's taken to make sure your identity. The IRS is really stepping their game up here from what I hear. So um, that, uh, that's good news. Hit on just real quick, like deadlines here, because, you know, these payments are going to start, it's July 15th and come every single 15th you know, July, August, September, October, November, December, except for August, it's like the 13th or something. It's a weird date, but just hit on like, when's the deadline to you unenroll and, and kind of how's that work? Yeah. So each month there actually is a deadline for you to unenroll. Unenrolling is a one-time process. Once you unenroll, you cannot re-enroll. So if you miss the first month and you still get that payment, you can unenroll for the remaining payments. You just can't re-enroll. So in order to unenroll if, if for this very first payment for July 15th, that deadline is actually today, June the 28th. Um, the, there's a rule about three days before the first Thursday of the month in order to unenroll. The easiest way is there's actually a chart that the IRS has provided you that you can look at those dates um, on when they are for each specific month. So that's what I would recommend. Go to the IRS uh, FAQs and look at that chart to figure out the dates you have to unenroll for each month by. Yeah, no, it gets, gets confusing on those deadlines. So, you yeah. know, in, in the show notes, just drop down here. We'll, we're going to put a link to the portal where you go to unenroll. And then also we're going to put a link to, I'm going to call them these FAQs. There's about seven FAQs that hit on the deadlines. It's got a chart that specifically says the, the unenrollment deadline for the payment date. Um, but just to hit this once again, this is to unenroll for the advanced child tax credit the default is you're going to get the money if you qualified based on your most recently tax return. So the default is you're going to get the money unless you want to opt out and unenroll to not receive it. And then I'm not going to, we're not going to go into, we recommend to do or don't that's at individuals, each, you know, particular tax situation. Um, but if you want to unenroll for the July 15th, do it today, right? Buzzsaw. That's right. If you if you don't want any of these payments, you've got to unenroll by today. Sweet. OK, well, Buzzsaw, appreciate it, man. Again, we will put links to these in the show notes. And if you guys have questions on this, let us know. But I think it's fairly straightforward on how it works. Just kind of follow the directions and you should be good. So anyway, Buzzsaw, appreciate it, man. Happy Monday to you. Absolutely. Same we'll talk to you. talk to you guys out there soon. All right. We'll see you guys. All right.